Hey guys, Kenny here, the Hobby Cop, and thanks for stopping by. Um, just doing a quick video of what sold over the weekend. Uh, it wasn't really a lot, but anyways, I will take any sales. I picked up, probably in the last video you saw, a big auction lot, so I'll get all that stuff listed. Um, so far today, we have two sales. Um, oh, I don't have them up on the computer yet. Um, we have it there. Uh, you can't really see them. We have an Elgato uh, game capture device HD with cables. Uh, we were waiting for the buyer uh, to pay for that, and they did late Friday, so they missed the shipping day on Friday. So I'm gonna ship that out on Monday, and then also a vintage snapback trucker hat. I'll throw it up here. I think I paid a buck ninety nine or two ninety nine. Actually, no, three thirty with taxes. So it was probably like two something. Um, Anyway, I put it up for $27.99. There was no comps. Uh, somebody offered me $10. I countered it with $17.99 uh, plus shipping. I think I charged them $9 shipping. Um, and it'll cost me roughly that. So after everything's taken out, I'll make like 14 bucks off that. I think maybe I undershot myself because I just listed it yesterday. But still good. I'll take it. Profit is profit. Uh, but it was just a, a, these vintage hats are hard to tell because... Uh, a lot of times there's not ones listed, so it is in here. Let's see if I can do this one-handedly. So it's this hat. That's an old map. Uh, there, an island fertilizer corduroy hat. Uh, old snapback mesh. Uh, nice little hat there. So that we'll put that down there. We'll take the shipping closet. Then in here we got Sadie's water and fireworks. It's been raining ever since Canada Day. And here's the. Elgato um, gaming capture thing here that's the buyer bought, finally paid for. Uh, I think I had it listed for a hundred bucks, and it was something that I had personally from years ago, uh, works and everything like that. So let's go ship that. Okay, so we're okay, so we're here in the shipping closet. I shut the door. Kids are watch TV in the background. Um, shipping out the hat. I need to buy like six and a half by six and a half by six and a half uh, boxes. Um, I need to really up my box game here because right now I'm just using stuff from around the house. So I'm gonna use this goldfish from um, Costco, and I cut down the corners, and I'm just gonna make it into a, a good hat box. And the Elgato gaming thing, I'm just gonna wrap it up in tissue paper in a bag, and then craft paper, and we'll ship that out. So I'll see you when we're done. All right, so I'm just jumping back into this video. I already packaged up the other two things that you just saw, uh, but also while um, the day was king, only halfway through Sunday. Uh, I sold something here in bin E. Uh, just put it in there yesterday. And it was, where is it? This Marvel uh, Legends of Spider-Man, uh, Miles Morales. Um, I think I paid $5 for it. And I listed it for 30, I think it was 35.99, 34.99. There's some Ninja Turtles. And then, and actually this hat, it's a pretty cool hat. Team Skidoo leather suede. I listed for eighty nine dollars. There's none on there. None have sold. Um, and I saw some that were not as cool selling for fifty nine dollars. So anyway, somebody gave me an offer of thirty nine ninety nine. I think even though I paid like three bucks for it, um, I think I'll decline it. I just put it up last night, um, so I'm in no rush. It's not my living. This is fun. But anyway, we'll pack this up. Uh, I can't remember if I just told you that. Anyway, I got an offer. I listed it for $34, $35.99. Got an offer of $29.99 and I accepted it. I only paid five bucks. Uh, and the buyer has paid $9 shipping. Um, I actually think it'll probably cost about $8 to ship, but the extra dollar you can save for packaging and stuff like that. Anyway, on to the end of the video. Okay, so we got the things packaged up. Top is the Elgato Gaming, like my tuck tape. Uh, the bottom is the hat. You know what, whatever works and gets it safe. Um, I got 100% feedback so far, good. So I'm trying to keep it that way. You get good feedback based on if it gets there safe or not, if it looks pretty. So anyway, it's gonna get there. Um, so I'll ship these out and we'll do some more thrifting tomorrow. Um, question for you guys, so I'm packaging up that Miles Morales toy and it's in a Shreddy's box not sponsored by Shreddy's but um, so I'm gonna wrap this in craft paper I'm just curious what do you guys do maybe the newer resellers out there what do you guys do for boxes I kind of just find ones around the house uh, make make do I should probably invest in boxes what did you guys do when you were starting out did you invest in boxes or you just found stuff around the house let me know all right so there's Miss Lila and guess what Lila 
another hat sold. This is a Carhartt hat, digital camo. I think I just accepted an offer for what, $28 maybe, plus shipping. So I'll put up in the top corner how much that costs. But I'm running out of boxes, like I just said a second ago. So I am making a makeshift one here. Oh, I filled up makeshift one here. So wish me luck.